another peer review. Of course, it's about efficiency. This one is about driving the back knee. Okay, this is one kind of silly, but it is spread and people think that there's power in driving the back knee. The back knee is actually passive. So when you stride and you shift your weight and unload, yes, the back knee is gonna be like this. It's going to pinch a little bit, okay? The idea of the pinch is to keep you from rotating, okay? But the problem is for young hitters is they'll go swing and they'll keep it, their leg bent. So they'll swing and then their leg is still like this. Well, I can't shift very hard because I'm at risk of going forward, okay? I can't block, but if I, if I go passive for a second, that's fine, passive, but then I have to separate my legs, but it has to be so fast so that you can't even see it. Like if you cover my lower body, you wouldn't even be able to tell I'm transferring and returning and firming up. You wouldn't see the forward motion because I'm doing it all in one fell swoop. It's, it's smooth, it's connected, right? Shift, return, but what I'm doing, I'm not doing this. I'm keeping my leg down like that, okay? I'm unstable. You can't rotate strong on an unstable platform. Gotta get stable. So driving that back knee, you don't drive from the hips either. You know, this is not something you wanna rotate first anyways. So you, you don't wanna, you don't want this to be the first move. You want shifting to be the first move. So then it, 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 it kind of secures your hips a little bit so that they can resist the upper body rotation against your lower body. I know how hard it is to see when you're looking at a player, it seems like the hips and shoulders are driving together. Well, maybe they're together for a little while, but the shoulders are across the hips in your start, and then they're eventually across the other side in your finish. So you're, technically you swing across your body, okay? That, and that's how you block across your body. So you can block, and we'll, we'll go over that in another video, but you can block across your hip, you can block with posture, and you can block correctly with your legs. So you gotta have, you gotta have a combination of all three. But if you start to fire with your back leg and rotate your back leg, a lot of players will squish the bug like this or just rotate their knee real quick. That way they're, they're going into ro rotation right away and uh, that's gonna cause you to quit, okay? That, that'll be like an arm swing. It'll be hard to keep the ball fair, especially an inside pitch. And if you get a ball out of the plate, you have nothing. You have nothing to hit with. 